At her appointment. Ooh. <laughs> it's gonna get weighed and measured and all that stuff. You ready? You ready to go? Good morning everyone. As you guys just saw, I never know if I'm using like the right words like as you guys just saw or if you guys just seen. Either way, you know what I'm trying to say. Um, we had Brielle's four month checkup today and it went good. Um, she weighs 13 pounds, six ounces and um, that means she's gained five pounds since she was born. So she's um like on the smaller side, like I'm small as well anyway. I'm five foot one, like 103 pounds maybe. I think like 103 or 105. So I'm petite, so I'm pretty sure she'll probably be petite as well. Since Kevin's, um, he's not the tallest person. So he's kind of like um, average anyway. He's not extremely tall. So she's just going to be a small little munchkin too. She is 23 inches, 23 and 3 fourth inches. I think I said that right. She was born 19 and a half inches, so she's grown. She's going. She's growing well, so that's good. Um, I'm not. I don't really understand like when they say like, oh, they're in the blah blah percentile. I don't understand that. So if someone could like leave in the comments below like what they mean by that, um, that would be helpful. I'm. Um, I don't remember what percentile her doctor said she was in don't remember I wish I did I think so I don't know but either way she looks good when she was born um, like at her two month checkup or her one month checkup yes it was her one month she didn't gain the best of weight so they were kind of like iffy about like her weight gain so um, they just basically said like oh make sure she when she looks like she wants to like suck or whatever just put it on your boob so that was like when she was one month old. So she had like a little bit of a dip in her weight, but that's fine now. She is gaining great. Well, she's, she's gaining perfect now. And she just looks good. She did get her shots. She actually cried more before her shots because like she's at this stage now where she like stranger danger right now. So she cries when, oh, that's cute, my vacuum dog fur in there she cries when like a stranger is like holding her or touching her like her doctor was you know checking her vitals and all that stuff and she just starts crying she was also cranky and hungry because it was her nap time and she was hungry so she cried more than before like than when she got her shots um when she got her shots of course she did cry but she's she's doing good now she gets her two band-aids and she's just hanging out right now playing she just woke up from her little mini nap um, we're gonna watch out just in case she gets any kind of fever we have a uh, baby Tylenol just in case but so far so good I hope she doesn't get any kind of fever so her next appointment is her six month checkup and we're gonna see how much you weigh then you perfect little girl yeah. 
usually when they get their shots, they sleep for a while afterwards. But here she is up and playing. See your little boo-boos? Yeah. What kind of band-aids are they? Oh, they're cute. She's such a doll. How you feeling, babe girl? You gonna be petite like mama? Mommy and daddy? <laughs> She's like, yeah, mom, just let me play, okay? I had a rough morning. Oh, you're okay, honey. I asked her doctor when she thought was a good um, time to start introducing her to like, like um, avocados and like foods like that, like baby foods. She said roughly, you know, six months, which is, uh, um, sounds good to me uh, I know some doctors say oh yeah four months is good but personally um, what we feel Kevin and I we think like five ish to six months is a good start for her um, I want to start her off with um, avocado bananas and and sweet potato like foods like that and um, we're gonna take it slowly of course we don't want to like we just want to make sure she doesn't have any food allergies but yeah, I'm excited for that, but it's not going to be anytime soon because she has started like watching us like put food in her mouth, but that doesn't mean she's ready because, you know, which I took. But I, I know she's not ready for foods right now, but yeah, so what else, honey bun? Kevin came with us to the appointment, but now he's back at work. He should be home later though. Um, what else? And this Friday coming up, coming up, um, Kevin's work peoples, like everyone he works with, like not just who he works with, but like tons of people. There's a pool on base that we're all invited to go to. It's like a family day for everybody who wants to go and we're going and we're going to use Brielle's pool float that we just got from my mom, her Grammy. And we're gonna put her in that and see how she likes it. And I got myself a new like bathing suit top. I'm not comfortable wearing a two piece right now. Just because, I mean, I just had a baby four months ago. I'm not like nervous or anything, but I, I'm just more comfortable right now just to wear like, uh, I'll show you guys um, the vi um, what it looks like when we go to the pool. That video will be up Saturday since so it's on a Friday. So yeah, I just have like that dark line still in my belly button for whatever reason. It's still like dark inside of it. I don't know why. It looks weird, but I do clean my belly. Um, it's because I had a big belly when I was pregnant with her. So my belly button probably was pushed out so far that it's like it doesn't know what to do now that I don't have a baby inside. I don't know. But... The rest of the day, we're just gonna hang out. I don't wanna do too much since she just got some shots. So we're just gonna have a, a nice day to chill. And yeah, um, I'm feeling much better today. I'm not like weird. I'm not in a weird mood like yeah, I was yesterday. So we'll see what else we do. I'm not too sure. What else are we gonna do this weekend? Upcoming appointments for not this week, but next week is my dentist appointment and then my orthodontist appointment so i'll keep you guys updated with that and now i'm gonna stop talking because i keep on rambling i'm just in a good mood plus i had caffeine so i'm like chattery right now because caffeine plus nicole equals blah okay you got the hiccups shake shake do 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 miss brielle does sleep through the night. She wakes up maybe a couple times, but when she wakes up, she us she usually just wants to nurse, and then she goes right back to sleep. She loves to play with her toys. Loves to roll over onto her belly. Hello, Duke. What else? Four months going strong for breastfeeding, and she's in her three to six month clothing. She still fits in some three months, but mostly. Three to six months. Did you just toot? Yeah. Her eye color is still blue, and I believe she's going to be having be a redhead, just like her mama. 
<laughs> oh, really? She's not teething, but I do believe maybe when she's six months old is when you'll I'll start to see some teeth. But I do have that teething necklace because it's cute, and I'm I'm I heard that it will help before they get their teeth in. She drools a lot. <laughs> she likes her bath. She likes bath time. She likes to go outside. She, she, she doesn't mind in, being in her car seat when we're in the truck going to stores. She, she talks. She tries to sing when Mama sings to her. Isn't that right, honey? Yeah. She's just overall getting so smart and so big every day and I love being able to watch her grow and reach all her milestones. <laughs> yeah. She's a happy, healthy baby girl. And I can't believe she's already four months old. <laughs> yeah. Her naps are okay depending on the day. Usually it's um, an hour. <laughs> And sometimes she just does not like naps. Maybe it's maybe it's like 20 minutes, but and on a good day it's like two hours. She's also started blowing raspberries <laughs> and trying to make bubbles out of her mouth. Isn't that right, pumpkin? Do you have anything to tell them? Love you. You keep on farting. <laughs> Why? You stinky butt. And baby nails are daggers. You have to cut them like every two seconds. Yeah, I'm exaggerating, but that's what it feels like. Like, these nails hurt. Yes, they do. Do you have anything to say about her four month update? Hold on, on that note, let me mute the TV. I got you. She's good. You just got out of work, so how was her appointment? Did you like her doctor and all that fun stuff? Yeah, she was nice. She was nice. Mm -hmm. And you want to start her on on um, baby solids, or, well, baby food at what's like, how old? Uh, I'd say five yeah. months. Like five-ish, five and a half months, closer to six, because I feel like then, by then she'll Seem like she wants to eat some people's foods. Probably. Should have better off too. Yeah. But so far she seems fine. She's napped here and there. And she doesn't seem warm. She's been playing. So looks like you're a happy baby. You happy? She is, and apparently Duke's happy too. He just wants to come visit me now. Yeah. He's your favorite dog ever, isn't Duke's he? Duke's weird. He likes to test my patience. But when Kevin's back, he's all like, Hi, hi. I'm a good doggy, right? He thinks he is. <laughs> but he likes to steal towels. Yeah, I told him that. <laughs> so, yeah. I'll answer you guys. Look at this. I ate, like, almost all of them. Don't judge me. Oh, you're getting judged. <laughs> So we're gonna end the vloggity vlog here. I hope you liked her four month update. She's always smiling, but she always looks so serious when I put this camera in front of her face. Why are you so serious? You smiley baby. Yeah, she has the biggest smile when she does smile. But we will see you guys tomorrow. I don't know what I'm doing tomorrow, but we'll see now, won't we? Usually I don't know until I get home. Oh, well, that was a really flattering angle. Hey. Say bye. You didn't say bye. Oh, bye. bye. Okay, bye.